Welcome to a new video, here are the 10 incredible places that science still cannot explain. Number 1. Magician, an immersive mystery. The Magician Grottoes are a collection of 194 caves carved into the site of Magician Hill in China. In this example of rock architecture you can find more than 7,200 Buddhist sculptures and 1,000 square meters of murals. They were first thoroughly explored in 1952 by a team of Chinese archaeologists from Beijing, who devised the numbering system still used today. They are just one of many Buddhist grottoes in this area of northwestern China, close to the main routes connecting China and Central Asia. It is likely that the grotto shrines in China served two functions before the arrival of Buddhism. They could have been used as local shrines to worship ancestors or various nature deities. These sites, along with others along the Eastern Silk Road, were inscribed on the UNESCO World Heritage List as part of the Silk Roads in 2014. Number 2. The Mysterious Churches of Lalabella, Ethiopia. In Ethiopia, there is a city called Lalabella, which at first glance might not seem very interesting, except for its churches. However, these churches are not only interesting, they baffle even modern scientists. The reason? They were carved from stone and volcanic rock, and each of the three churches is unique and inimitable, distinguished by its style. Some of these structures are situated in pits and surrounded by rocks, while others are carved directly into the cliffs. According to scientists' calculations, they were rebuilt in the 12th and 13th centuries AD, and it only took 25 years to build them from scratch. This begs the question, how were the ancient inhabitants of Ethiopia, who were not known for their advanced knowledge and skills, able to create such skillful and incredible churches with primitive tools in such a short time? Researchers still do not fully understand this riddle, but locals have their own answer, the help of divine forces. According to local legend, both ordinary workers and angels descended to earth to participate in the creation of these churches. The collaboration between humans and celestial beings gave rise to architectural monuments that remain a mystery today. In Africa, there are more mysterious buildings than most people know about and the churches of Lalabella are a unique architectural treasure on the continent. Number 3. Medieval Dolphin Tomb, archaeologists were finishing an excavation at Chapel Dam who in the English Channel when they made an unexpected and puzzling discovery. Archaeologists reasonably assumed that a carefully cut grave plot would contain the remains of a deceased human being. Instead, they discovered the bones of a dolphin in the grave. The discovery was made at the site of a medieval religious retreat that was once inhabited by monks seeking solitude. Experts believe the bones date back to the 14th century and the remains appear to have been intentionally buried rather than simply buried underground. Experts aren't sure how to interpret this strange discovery. People ate dolphins during the medieval period but it seems unlikely that the animal would have received such a thorough burial if it had only served as food. The body may have been buried in a hole and covered with salt to preserve it, but it was never found. The dolphin may have had religious importance to the island's monks. The remains of the dolphin have been removed from the area and will be examined by a marine expert. However, how and why the animal arrived on the island may remain a mystery for many years. Number 4. The Ringed Rocks of Pennsylvania. At the top of a hill in Pennsylvania, there is a field full of strange rocks that no one knows how they appeared there. There is no higher cliff nearby, so they couldn't fall there after a landslide. Natives say these rocks have been there even before European settlers arrived. It is believed that it was a natural phenomenon with no known cause. While researchers continue to ponder this discovery, they are concerned with a bigger mystery, these rocks make a strange sound when you hit them. That is, they emit a tone that sounds like a drum cymbal. Some theories explain this, 
but why they make this strange noise is still being determined. If you hit a single rock, the sound is barely audible, as the pitch is lower than what the human ear can perceive. However, if you work them, the tones interact and produce a sound that you can hear. Number 5. The 250 Rock Cut Tombs of Al Hamadiyya. In May 2021, an accidental discovery of 250 rock cut tombs was made in the Al Hamadiyya necropolis near the city of Sohar. These tombs span more than two millennia, from 2200 BC until the year 30 BC, during the Ptolemaic era. The tombs are small in size and the objects found suggest that the deceased did not belong to a high social rank. Vases, ceramic fragments, human and animal bones, funerary plates and small alabaster vessels were found. The most recent burials are believed to have occurred around 30 BC, coinciding with the end of the Ptolemaic period and the beginning of Roman control in Egypt. It is possible that those buried were officials and leaders of the city administration playing a crucial role in administrative management. Number 6. The Underground Church of St. John. Our next exciting story takes us to France, more specifically to the idyllic town of Odin. Here is the monolithic underground stone-carved church of St. John, which delights historians and tourists. According to what scholars have discovered, the church was originally designed to house valuable religious objects that were kept in a reliquary and protected from thieves. In the following centuries, the St. John Church was also used as a cemetery. Some historical sources suggest that the workers who carved the church directly into the limestone rock were inspired by the returning crusaders who brought back stories of underground temples and treasure chambers. Although the baptismal font in the center of the church was probably designed between the 4th and 9th centuries, it is possible that the church did not receive its final form until the 12th century. Number 7. Tawanaku, the Gate of the Sun. Let's stay a while in Bolivia and travel near the famous Titicaca River. Here an ancient settlement of about 4 square kilometers was discovered that, according to historians, reached its maximum splendor around the year 800 AD. Between 10,000 and 20,000 inhabitants. Numerous objects of historical relevance were discovered, such as monumental structures, decorated ceramics, and megalithic blocks. While the objects were quickly assigned to a people who lived more than 1,200 years ago, the monolith called Puerta del Sol continues to cause speculation to this day. What it is in detail would probably remain unexplained forever, since historians, despite all the research, have not discovered any concrete clues about the meaning and purpose of the monolith. In Bolivian popular belief, the Puerta del Sol is considered a mystical place that connects the world of humans with that of the gods. Number 8. The Golden Rock, Burma. Four hours from Rango, in Burma, we find the picturesque town of Kayaitio. This place, which seems lost in time, receives several tourists a year due to an immense golden rock a thousand meters above sea level. The rock seems to defy all the laws of gravity. According to the ancient Buddhist tradition that they have honored for 2,500 years, powerful deities placed a huge stone on Mount Kayaitio. Since then, the rock has been swinging in the air and belief holds that it is maintained thanks to Buddha's magical hair, which prevents it from falling into the void. Although it seems ready to break at any moment, it has remained standing for 2,500 years. Even nature itself has not managed to knock it off the mountain. It is said that only a woman can achieve it, therefore women are prohibited from touching this sacred piece. Number 9. Exploring Nan Madal, the Mysterious Archipelago Nan Madal, have you ever heard of this place? Probably not, since it is an archipelago in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Although in such remote and paradisiacal corners you could expect only beaches and crystal clear waters, 
in Nan Madal you will find mysterious stone structures. Among the discoveries are palaces, temples, tombs and homes built between the 7th and 16th centuries AD. The question that arises is, who would need to build something so grand in such a remote place? Scientists believe that the local elite and members of high society lived in Nan Madal, perhaps as a residence for the local government. However, there is something strange, there are practically no sources of fresh water on the archipelago. Is this location suitable for a capital or central government residence? In my opinion, it wouldn't make sense. There is another version that suggests that the Nan Madal complex had a cult and religious significance, which seems more plausible. However, it's still just one version. The complex is heavily damaged, making it difficult to understand its true purpose. Scientists have not yet solved this riddle. Number 10. The Maiden's Tower in Azerbaijan. The people of the Middle Ages had built exciting structures in the capital Baku. The so-called Maiden's Tower is located in the old town of the metropolis, dates back to the 12th century and, together with the 15th century palace. The Maiden's Tower forms a complex of historical monuments that was included in the list of historical monuments of UNESCO World Heritage in 2001. Inside the tower, there is, among other things, a museum that tells the exciting history of the Azeri capital, Baku. The Maiden Tower is one of the most characteristic national buildings of Azerbaijan and is surrounded by a multitude of legends and myths deeply rooted in the country's history. Based on these legends, the Azeri artist created a Baku Maiden's Tower ballet in 1940, which has remained popular in the modern era and is one of Azerbaijan's best-known cultural exports.